Greetings, special centurions, and welcome, fellow YouTubers, back to Lauren. We are just outside of White Run and about to head round to the little alcove uh, in the base of White Run in order to loot it and kill the bandits there before heading back to White Run and carrying on with the Thieves Guild missions. While I've got full health, I'd like to initiate some combat and then allow it to regenerate in between because we don't really have a good way of uh, recovering health. The only way we can recover health is with health potions. Uh, I'm going to keep an eye out for Tundra. Uh, Tundra Cotton, sorry. While we're out here because with Tundra Cotton, we can make a healing salve which could be useful for healing up in between combat. So is this Tundra Cotton? No, this is just wheat, normal grass. So yeah, we need to find Tundra Cotton really while we're out here. Can't see any. I thought there'd be loads out here, but there's Nout. Nout all. Sweet Fanny Nout all. Oh well. Here's the alcove up ahead. Lavender. Just missed her. Archer. Got her that time. Die, damn you. Oh, I hit the rock. He's fucking drinking, this guy. Look at him. He's got ale in his Die. hand. Try and fight back. Ow! He boshed me in one hit, chat. He just insta boshed me. I did not expect that. Jesus. Uh, I think I'm probably going to load that because we could have done a lot better on the archery. And uh, a lot better in the combat. So, uh, yeah, rather than going all the way back, let's Welcome. just load it. Let Hope it doesn't crash. That was terrible, chat. He just fucking tonked me in the face. Oh, my gosh. Let's try that again. I got her that time. Did that kill her instantly? No, she's there. Oh, she sidestepped. Get her, mate. Come on. Okay. Me versus him now. Spit on you. Oh, crushed. Got him. Right. That's better. That's much better that time. Why has he got pirate stuff on? Look at all the armor he's got on him. He's got a lot of shit on him. Whoops, didn't mean to pick that up, but whatever. Whetstone. Can you even use whetstones? Have a look. Oh, he had a dwarven mace on him. Nice. Uh, the pirate bandana. That's what I didn't mean to pick up, so drop that. Let's see if we can use this whetstone. Use. Ah, uh, it requires an iron ingot. 
Harboring Hodges Core requires a steel ingot in order to use it. Okay. So you need uh, other items, other accessories. Drop a save because we're about to find, fight the leader. He's going to be a lot harder to defeat. Quick silver battle axe. Nice, I'll take that. Coin purse, I will take. Great. No. Don't want anything else here. Barrel of food. Alchemy Alimbic. Nice. Okay. Smuggler's Correspondence. Wow. A lot of writing reading there. I'm not going to read that. <laughs> Uh, that's the note talking about the skooma. That's too overpriced. Come on, any tundra cotton. Not reading all that, thank you. Finesse increased it. Okay, nice. <laughs> Skuma! Kajit, no, Kajit Caravan, Akari. Whoa, why is that worth so much? Potion of Fear, good. Smuggler's trade notes. The staff of Hazadoki. Go to the site of the ambush. Oh yeah, I remember that. We picked that up in the uh, Novus pack. There's like a staff that you can acquire. Right, when we pick this chest, uh, they, the bandits will appear. So we need to be prepared. Elvin Javelin, that's worth a decent amount, bit of money, and four lockpicks. Oh, I cut his head off. Oh, he crossbowed me before I could get to him. Well, I cut one of their heads off, and then the other guy crossbowed me as I was charging in. God, Sven is fucking useless. He just goes down instantly. Even oh, God, I fell over. Oh, my knees. My knees gave way. Oh, God, standing is so difficult. Right. Why is everyone screaming? What the fuck? Right, we're going to go back out there. And we're going to finish those fuckers. We're going to arch it down the crossbow dude and then kill the bandit leader by ganging up on him. Ha cha cha! Cartwheel out the door. I 
Actually, just thinking about it, the quickest way to get your health back is literally just to die. Because you spawn with full health every time you die, so... That's not a very conducive way to making the game fair or balanced. Oh well, that's just how it is. Let's go, Sven. You were fucking useless in the last fight. Well, actually, to be fair, he distracted the crossbow guy and the leader long enough for me to take out the other guy, so that's better than nothing. Otherwise, all three of them would have ganged up on me. Sven, you're not completely fucking useless. You're just pretty fucking useless. How's that? I want to see if this guy wants to yes. read the note that I found. Take a look. Let's see what we can sell him. Dwarven mace. We might give that to Sven, actually. No, he's got a magic weapon. Elven javelin. Quicksilver battle axe. Leather armor with ring mail. Pirate's fine first mate armor. Alchemy Alimbic. I wonder if you use that next cluster. Cast Iron Pot. Empty Potion Bottles. Amethyst. Okay. May your old I do you regret making this journey. Is that cotton? No, it's daffodils. Ben, where are you? I need you, buddy. That's all you've got. Please stop lagging. Someone's gonna get hurt. You. Ow! <laughs> I missed my attack, and he just boshed me. And where the fuck was Sven? Of course, nowhere to be seen. So fucking useless. I need him to run in and tank. That's his fucking job. Sven, you useless fucking prick. Let's try that again. Come on in. Hopefully Just Sven will actually come this time. <clears throat> they do way too much damage to us at the moment to actually take them head on face to face when they're higher level than us so that's what Sven's for he needs to take the first couple of hits and then we can attack him while he's taking hits attack the enemy while they're while Sven's tanking hits and then we kill the enemy before he gets a chance to kill Sven and me because Sven's never fucking around can't wait till we can get Lydia but that's not gonna be for a long while chat it's gonna be a good long while before we get a house curl Host Carl. Uh oh. 
think it's crashed. Well, that's aggravating. It seems to have crashed. Yeah, it's crashed. Oh well. Let's end it. Reload. Do 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 do. Load a backup chat. This will take about five minutes or so. Use this time to go grab yourself a drink, go to the loo, do anything you got to do, or just simply skip ahead in the video to when it's loaded and we are carrying on. It's a bit frustrating, but it's fucking modded Skyrim. It's what you get. It's what you get. I'm going to use this time myself to go to the loo, to get a drink, play with my doggy a bit. I'll be right back once it's loaded, chat. See you all in a minute. Right, chat, we are back and loading in to where we left off. Gonna fight the brigand leader, hopefully, or this time I'll actually wait for Sven to show up so that he can tank some of the hits and then we'll cut that fucker's head off. See where Sven is. Nowhere to be seen. Fucking nowhere. Might as well hunt this deer while I'm waiting for the idiot to catch up. No, nope, we got away. We don't do enough damage yet. Sven, where are you, you fucking cretin? Let's wait an hour, see if he shows up. Where the fuck is he, for fuck's sake? He's so fucking useless, honestly. The point of having a fucking follower doesn't even fucking show up half the time. That guy attacking the horse. I'm invisible. They're attacking the horse for some reason. Whoops, I thought my aimer was over him. This one's loot is mine, so back off. They're fighting the horse. We took out the archer again. We did some decent damage to the leader, but fucking needs Sven. The whole point of him being around is that he fucking tanks for a bit. Fucking prick. They were attacking the horse for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe because I shot the deer that like caused them to. Right, are you actually gonna come and do something, you incompetent fuckhead?
come on, keep coming, you fucking idiot. Sure, Sven's actually following. Good, Sven's on his route. Let's go and hunt this elk, it should be almost dead. It fucking turned at the last moment, chat. Oh, it's still alive. It's still got plenty of health. This one doesn't, though. Damn it. Fucking dear. So irritating. Right, let's find the um, bandit leader. There he is. Do something. Right, at least he got in there. At your best? Huh? No one bests an order. Twenty. Good work, Sven, you did something. Well made quarter staff, steel arrow, helmet, old imperial armor, orcish forge master armor, old imperial gauntlets, heavy armor, orcish berserker gauntlets, old imperial boots. We'll take those, take all that stuff and see which is better for, um, for us and Sven. Right, let's go loot the other corpses. on him and what about this guy 
Are you eating the corpse, horse? Is that what you're doing? You're eating the corpse? Fucking psycho horse. No wonder they were attacking it. Demon horse! Right, let's see what this equipment is. Evasion 250 and weight 15. That's way better. Give me plus 100 armor. That'll give me 30 more armor. That'll give me 30 more armor. Shame he didn't have a helmet as well. Still here. Yeah, I can see that. Uh, let's trade some what things. What do you want me to carry? Uh, I actually want him to wear those, so he does one hand damage. Because, yeah, the, the weight difference and warmth difference isn't that much better. And the armor difference, actually, more importantly, is only six, so we'll take those off him. And he can use the Vigilant Gauntlets. He looks awesome Lead now on. in his Imperial armor. He's going to be tanking like a beast. A save in case it crashes. Right, we need to go to Halted Streams Camp now. Save a kitty there. I fight over its head twice, chat. I'm in trouble. Owie. Oh, it boshed me good. It got me good. Still don't have the armor to fight saber cats, apparently. Blah. Oh dear. Oh dear, chat. Saber cats are still too dangerous. Right, let's go speak to Old Free Battleborn about the um, Thieves Guild mission. If I'd hit with those two arrows, we would have killed it, but we obviously didn't hit, so. Fait la vie. Cartwheel out the door, ha tra ha tra. The finest cuts. See if we got any food. We need some food. Uh, red apples. Fresh 
Mm. Sell everything that we need to sell. See if we've got any tundra cotton in here, because I've got Nord mead. And I think you need mead to make... Welcome. It's either mead or Develop. ale. Let's have a look at the recipe. Uh, healing poultice. It says in weak alcohol, preferably in ale, yeah. We need, we need some tundra Welcome. cotton. I'd even buy one of your relatives if you're... Trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. Powder of flames. Yeah. Potion of fear. Potion of paralysis. Potion of water breathing. Cure disease. Cure poison. This fire. And then all of these are health ones. You need all of them. Um, let's see what he's got in terms of ingredients. Any tundra cotton? No. Let's Do go talk to the back. ingredients lady and see if she... Oh, I wanted to sell my skooma. Is the skooma stolen or something? No. So why can't I sell the skooma? Don't know. Weird. Maybe people don't want to buy skooma because it's like a, a toxic drug or something. Who knows? Right, let's look for tundra cotton. Is that tundra cotton? It is. Nice. So there's tundra cotton just outside. Let's see if there's any more anywhere. Yeah, there's some here. Any more tundra cotton anywhere? Had enough of fish and fowl. Treat yourself and your kin to a choice cut of steak or a tender rack of ribs. You need anything, my lad. Okay, so first we need to do something to the tundra cotton at the tanning rack, which is just down here. Is there any more tundra cotton anywhere? Tundra cotton, tundra cotton. Tundra, there's some tundra cotton. And some more here. Take some more mead as well, that'll be handy. Oh, there's tundra cotton behind here as well, nice. Okay, so first you do something to it in the tanning rack. Take three pieces of tundra cotton and refine it at a tanning rack. Soak the cotton in weak alcohol, preferably in ale. Add three blue mountain flowers to the bottle and shake it thoroughly. Maybe you don't need to do anything in the tanning rack and it's just talking about that for flavor. I don't understand why we can't do anything here though. Oh, healing poultice, I just saw it. Oh, I'm in clothing now. Healing poultice, it's down here somewhere. Or not. There we go. Healing. Healing poultice. Uh, 
Oh, we need blue mountain flowers. Okay. So there should be some around. Should be enough for now. Healing focus. Two Nord Mead, three Tundra Cots, and three Blue Mountain Flowers. And what does it do? Uh, healing poultice, where is it? Healing, is that it? Was that it? No. It's called Healing Poultice. So, oh, there it is. Herbal medicine, which is rubbed on the skin, for me, a crust that enhances natural regeneration. Stress, so stress suppresses its effect, so it's often applied before sleep. It contains enough amount for nearby companions, but dries quickly after being opened. Okay, so you use it, and then when you're on low health, you use it, and then you sleep. And it heals you as you sleep. Good to know. Okay, well, we're full health. So, anyway, let's go. So, I don't need to use it at the moment. Drop a save. It's good to have a couple of those. I'm going to try uh, finding more of them. That was purple. Uh, where are we going? Where are we going? Up here. Talk to this guy. Ulfrid Battleborn. We need more Nord Mead in order to be able to uh, make more of it. So I'm going to keep an eye out for Nord Mead. That's weird. It's like saying he's in there, but it's not saying go inside. Uh, is it fucked up? I think it's fucked up, yeah. He's like inside the wall, but not inside the wall. Yeah, it's completely fucked, chat. Tundra cotton. Wow, there's tundra cotton everywhere, actually. I was worried it'd be a scarce resource. Daughter's letter. Okay, well, I can't do anything, obviously, while he's stuck in a wall. Let's grab these butterflies. Sorry, it's only the monarch butterfly that gives you health. Alright, we have to wait for him to unglitch and come out of the wall, so let's uh, go out and do something else. There's another monarch butterfly over here. I want to come grab it. Come to House Greymane. See if they've got any Nord Mead inside that we can nick and make healing pulses with. Can't pick it up because it's in the silver bowl. And the silver bowl's too high for us to reach. Can't steal it from there either. Oh, 
Huh. And he gnawed me down in here? Oh, he's down here. Okay. Here we go. Does it have to specifically be Nord Mead or can it just be any kind of mead? I wonder. Ooh, there's some good stuff in here. Walker Tusk and Mammoth Tusk. We'll leave the Mammoth Tusk in here for the moment and just remember that it's here. Alright, let's get out of here. See if uh, we can craft anything with what we've got. Okay, this guy's out now. Right. Why are you speaking to me? Uh, Delvin Mallory sent You're me. You're here, and not a moment too soon. If anything should happen to Arn, there'll be hell to pay. Who the fuck is Arn? A close friend of mine. We fought together on the battlefield for many years until old age got the better of us. Now it's up to me to save him one more time. This time, from the executioner's block in solitude. Solitude? Why am I here in white? The city guard in solitude is seeking on for a serious crime. When he fled here, he was arrested for drunken behavior. Can well, that's you imagine? not a clever thing to do. If you're on the run from the he's law, the last thing you want to do is start causing a fracas. He's in white run, so there's still a chance to save him. Hold a moment. This is more than a simple prison break. I want to have Arn's name stricken from the record books permanently. I'm setting him up with a new identity. It's the only way to throw the guard permanently off his trail. So what's the, job? the job is twofold. First, steal a letter that was sent from Solitude warning White Run's guard to be on the lookout for Arn. The second is to change Arn's name in the prison registry to his new identity. Sounds easy. If it was easy, I would have hired a local thug instead of a professional. You see, both of these items are kept inside Dragon's Reach. And they don't allow visitors inside the Jarls or the Steward's Chambers. I can do it, One no problem. Thing. If you get caught, I can't afford to be connected to you. Remember that before you do anything stupid. You're stupid. Where's the letter being kept? I have eyes within Dragon's Reach. They tell me that all correspondence from other holes are sent to the Jarl's private chambers. Okay, that might be a bit harder than I thought. Any information it's on the It's a well-known fact that the steward keeps all of the records on White Run's prisoners in a large book. My sources tell me you can find that book in a study in his quarters. Change Arn's entry in the book to anything you want, and they'll be forced to let him go after he serves a few weeks. Okay. You watch yourself up. You watch yourself, ass clown. Butterfly, butterfly, butterfly. My butterfly. Okay, let's go craft some more healing poultices with all the mead that we just picked up. Is that more tundra cotton? No, I keep thinking it is. It's um, dragon's tongue. Oh, there's more tundra cotton here, though. Oh, there's tundra cotton everywhere out there. Jeez, okay. So all we're missing, really, is mead. Nord mead. This requires ale. Okay, so ale or mead works for it. That's good. Nice, okay. Let's go and sell all the rest of this stuff. Four healing pulses will do us for a little while. And there's always more tundra cotton and blue flowers all around White Run, so. Let me know if you see. Am I out of blue flowers actually? Is that the limiting factor at the moment? No, I've got three. Who are you, Sigurd? I'd even buy one of your relatives if you're looking to trinkets, odds and ends, that sort of thing. 
Yeah, you can't sell the skooma for some reason. They don't want it. Get rid of the wine. Get rid of the meads. And how much tundra cotton do I have? 17. Get rid of it because it's weighing me down. Do come back. Yeah, I will. Okay. How are we doing on time? All right, guys. So we've come to the end of the episode. In the next episode, we're going to be picking up tomorrow morning. We shall sneak into Dragon Reach Yarl's chambers and steal the letter and um, also a, uh, doctor the, um, the notes, the book. To change the name of the criminal we're trying to rescue but thank you so much for hanging out today guys i do hugely appreciate it i hope you're enjoying it as much as i'm enjoying playing i'm sorry about the crashes and the load times there's not much i can do about it really it's just part of skyrim in particular part of lorem um but yeah hopefully it won't uh, happen too often and uh yeah i hope you all have a terrific day I'll be back tomorrow morning with another episode of Lorem, so hopefully I'll see you all there for that, guys. If not, I'll try and see you in some other content I produce. I try and make content every single day now, so I'll wait till next time.